Yo, welcome back to the channel. So I'm back in the wood yard in Nosy B, checking out the progress on my furniture. And so far, it's not going very well. What is that building there? Looks like it's covered in oil. Let's go check it out. I like this, you know, just being a YouTuber, you can just go anywhere you want. Like you don't need permission. You just like take a trip wherever you like walk around people's land, check out their businesses, and just, that's the way it is. What is this? Oh, it's a wood drying area. It's like you build a fire underneath it and you dry out the wood. Look at that, like, oh my God. One big dark burnt building. Look at that, all the charcoal all over the walls and that. We wanna get locked in here when the fire's on. Wow, that's where they dry the wood. There's all the wood. Got plenty of it. Got that old computer in the distance over there, like. Oh my neck. Or a monitor, whatever it is. Uh, let's check out over here. He's got some vehicles, like, this guy's doing all right in business. Like, he's got 20 staff that work here. I think they do all sorts of things. Obviously, they do vehicles. You know, it looks like a scrapyard here, like. We've got like loads of posts that they're making over there. An old Audi. Don't see many Audis in Madagascar. Some old buses. Good for good for business these buses. But when they get old, like trying to find parts in Madagascar is a nightmare. There's an old Renault 4 here. Probably worth about six hundred dollars that as it is maybe eight hundred dollars or something fixed up in really really good condition worth two and a half thousand dollars that in madagascar use them as taxis and the locals in nosy b they love them all the french guys they love them to, to chop the roof off it and make it into a like little convertible car to get around the island on they love that but that's not what we're looking for we're looking for furniture they're now eight days behind schedule on making my furniture might be a bit noisy noisy in here but we'll pass through we've got um my dining dining table here the top of it has been made three meter long some staff working in here cleaning the wood let's check out out here got a lot of cement big pile of cement like it needs to be used up that before it's out of date I don't know why they've got cement but they must be building stuff as well like I don't know what they're building been working on this cabinet for a week and a half now orange it was white before make some nice doors and stuff like that those doors are sick. pretty good this is my bed here We've made me bed. There it is. There's the sides of it there. Underneath this dust here is my TV cabinet. There it is. Needs a clean. Should be nice when it's all ready to go. There's my coffee table here. Coffee table's looking good. And they've got the bedside tables as well. Two bedside tables. They're looking bit high but I think they'll be all right wow it's noisy and this is the dining table here three meter long dining table should be good for sitting four people aside and one at each end so ten people on this dining table I did tell him I come here a few hours ago I said listen just get these get these bits here these two tables finished get this coffee table finished get the bed tape the bed finished and the TV table and I'll come back at four o'clock and pick them up I said, don't worry about the um, don't worry about the dining table. I don't need that. I can get that like in two days. It's not a problem. He said, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll get them five bits finished for four o'clock. It's now about four fifteen, and these haven't been touched. They've still got little holes in, the, in them, like need filling up with filler, and then it needs a sand down. But he's, he's on about. Oh, I'll finish it today. It'll be finished. They're getting the top of it. Look, while I'm here, like they're getting the top out to show that they're making progress. That's going to need a bit of work, that, like, it's going to take another day or two, that, to finish. 
but it's a beast of a table and it's made out of um, palisandra which is like an endangered tree but like they'd already been chopped, chopped down years ago like the trees that I'm using to build these so now you can't you can't get palisandra very easily not not legally anyway but um, it's possible to still get it the Chinese they like to put it in containers fill containers full of it and, and export it to China to sell it to make furniture for a fortune this table here palisandra table here three meter long table I've paid um, 700 thousand ariari for it which is about uh, $200 $175 something like that for this table so it's pretty cheap really probably be a thousand pound table thousand dollar table anywhere else in, in the west and that but there you go that's it for this video I guess like give us a like give us a sub check me in the next video hopefully you'll see this furniture at my house all set up soon because at the moment i've got no furniture so thanks for watching bye for now from nosy b madagascar the wood yard